Chafes, brethren, and yo, my little babies, my Gintama people, yo. Now, if you guys, I'm pretty sure I uploaded episode 62 uh, before this video. So basically, you're getting three episodes of Gintama. I've been a little bit backed up when it comes to scheduling and everything. Like, uh, I took a day off here and there. And then, obviously, if I take a day off, uh, I, I get backed up uh, exponentially. So... We're still watching two episodes again, time a week. You know, I hope you guys enjoyed the serious arc that just passed by. And obviously, I'm enjoying, like, last week's episode, too. Just the, the, the most recent one was funny as hell. So we're going to keep continuing with episodes 63 and 64 today. If you guys have been enjoying the Gintama stuff, leave a like on this video, please. I would appreciate it. Subscribe if you guys have not done so already. Come over to Twitch so you guys can hang out with me in chat and watch me play games. I played Modern Warfare 2 on a modded lobby thing, but it makes the game better, and I got a nuke. I'll probably show you a clip before the actual thing starts. But yeah. And if you want to see the uncut version of this episode, go check it out on Patreon. Everything on is uh, on Patreon's uncut. No filters, no edits, no none of that. With that being said, let's get it started. Uh, what's the what's the thing called? Neo Armstrong. Dude, I'm like thinking in my head. It's, no, motherfucker. It's Neo Armstrong Cyclone Jet Armstrong Cannon. Like, suck about like, I, I don't know why I'm thinking to myself it's going to be easy. I'm going to try to get up to that top position, but th this, this shit's so fucking AIDS. This shit's AIDS as fuck. No, bro, move. Bro, get out of here, please. You're gonna ruin my streak. Oh, come on, I'm pissing. But then it doesn't end the game, which is good. I miss uh, using my PS3. Damn, toxic to have feeling in the stream. I don't give a fuck. Let's go, Luke. Thank you, another. What's up, another? Why am I always seeing you when I'm playing COD? Okay, well, remember when I said the chopper gunner and the sensitivity thing? Yeah, I'm smoking dick. I was, uh, bro, I've been using a Pavlo this whole time. Fuck that. Fuck that. Did you see the multi-kill I just got? Did you see the fucking multi-kill? I fucking annihilated their shit. So, ever since I did the opening reaction, um, if you guys haven't known, I did again some opening reaction. I would advise you guys to go check it out if you guys haven't. But I think I listened to all of them, right? And I went back to watch what I was saying about my opinions on it. Opening six. I still listen to opening six today. Opening six is my favorite Gintama opening. That shit is gas. Uh, I don't know why I like it so much. I think it's because it's really upbeat, but it's fire. And I love it. It's good. We're talking about dogs. Yes, dogs are great. Cats are great, too. As long as it kept fed, a cat will call anyone master. True. True, true. Yo, you're a pizza guy, my man. Why did he become a pizza? Oh, not again, bro. Why is he always? How do you not hear the moped? How do you not hear the moped? But what about your hemorrhoid, bro? Oh, he's oh, he's digging in his butt, bruh. Come on, man. He grabbed the fucking shonen. Oh my god, bro. He grabbed the fucking shonen jump, bruh. 
Oh, cool. Aw, fellas, she's so sweet. What the fuck? Your butt talks will suffer a great misfortune. What the fuck? It's like the pizza wants to be sucked into my mouth. True, true, true. It's like when the jerk does something good and he seems... Wait, what? And when sweet Shizuku-san does something bad, she seems awful. Like, I know they, I know this show, like, what it's doing right now, makes a lot of references towards, like, Japanese culture. You know, stuff that people living in Japan and, you know, would... Uh, totally automatically know what the fuck they're talking about it's like it's like a fucking show trying to reference like barney here like we'll know what the fuck it means right um i just wish i knew these references i know it says at the top of the screen but like i really i wish i had like a, a familiar familiarity with what they're talking about does it make sense you know larison bro it's just tight that everyone fucking just reads jump over there love that at a tenere, she mastered various arts of divination, including yin yang, fortune telling, and I Ching. Okay. It sounds like the same voice as Kagura. Hey, yo. Kidnapping someone who, uh, who can foresee such a scheme? Okay, okay. What the fuck is that? <laughs> Refers as a brand name for hemorrhoid cream. Fuck. Oh, and it was used up? Oh, what's up, High Caliber? Eh, shut up, High Caliber. You're an in t interesting kid. I guess you really can predict everything. Oh, that's true. I like the way she looks like that. She, like, there's no... You, you're never surprised by anything, so... I wouldn't say fun, but, like... Yeah, you're never surprised by anything. I guess that revolves around being fun. Or having fun. I have the power of divination and can foresee many things. I cannot predict what will be in the next issue of Jump. That's good. That's got... Okay, that's good. Damn. <laughs> a shoujo manga i've grown accustomed to being used as well as foreseeing it hey yo it's kind of getting deep a little bit chill because it's like i mean she does get paid for it but like it's her family right He's coming to, yeah, he'll bring it, but he's coming to kidnap you too. That's fucked. Of course, of course they hire them as their bodyguard, bruh. Of course. She's still so young, she's probably never even fallen in love. What the fuck? Neither have you, exactly. With the glasses, watch your head. <laughs> what? No kidding? Well, yeah, no shit. I mean, she's just naming the... I mean, I guess... It's, I guess she's get yeah, she she is psychic or whatever future telling. <laughs> Dude, they're really doing this. Um, W four, thank you for the fall, yo. You really wanted to play the part. How much money was in there? Life changing? No shot, right? When do you do a number two? It goes kaboom once again. Jesus. It's gonna be funny because this fool's gonna come kidnap her. This fool's gonna come fucking kidnap her, and then Gin's gonna be there. <laughs> like, fuck. Sheesh. That looks gas. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> Don't use all the sauce as an insult to the chef. <laughs> Consider what it would mean for the TV station, you idiot. We should have fun. This fool's fucking dousing that shit with soy sauce. Dude, I don't get how these fools can have conversation. I hate talking in the bathroom. Straight the fuck up. Get in there, fella. Show them what you're really about. How can you see in with that hair, man? Uh, Phantom Jack, thank you for the fall. Yo, welcome. Hey, yo, welcome, fellas. Welcome all the new fellas. We're watching Gin right now, obviously. It's like doing bad on a test, but you can't wait until you get the test back. You know, like when you mess up a math problem and wonder if maybe you got it right after all. Okay, I get that. Bro, when I was younger, when I was in high school, I was fucking guessing. I didn't give a fuck. Obviously, don't do that and be a good boy, but I was fucking. Yes, I was like, C, 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 straight the fuck up. Huh? Used to be younger? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Doesn't make me sad. It's just like living. This is depressing a little bit, but that makes me laugh. Can you stop doing that? When it comes to life, neither nor I am mere readers, we're the writers. Yo. Tell him, Gin. What's he about to do? Go do what you gotta do. He has he has this he has the uh shoujo anime or manga in his hand, bet straight up. Oh, that was kinda tight. Knocked. And what the fuck? That's not. That's not very like. How can I put this? That's not very like. Impressive what he just did, you know? All he did was just throw some shit off. He literally just threw three smoke bombs and they all knocked out. We'll take care of them. <laughs> oh shit, through the floorboards. <laughs> what brings you here at this hour? <laughs> Get him again. Fuck him up. I like I like that uh what's his name? Simpachi? No. Whatever his name is, the guy with the glasses. I'm glad that he's not just like some pushover. He, they actually like make him fight and like he does like okay. Even though Kagura beats his ass all the time. Simpachi, thank you. Your power of clairvoyance. Oh shit. I want you to foretell something for me. Oh, net, by the way. What are the odds of me winning if I betray those guys and come over to your side? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That was tight. I like that. You're a pitiful man who cannot live unless uh, it's amid amidst... I don't even know all these words. I don't know how to say these words. I'm stupid. You're not a cat. You're a cat monster. Where's Gin at, bruh? Where the fuck is Gin? Come help my mans. Oh, shit. Beat his ass. Did you see that? Our attack will surge forth upon you like overflowing toilet. Bro. Bro. Bro, what the fuck? What you got, girl? She gonna, she gonna, she gonna do some shit, huh? What you got? Show me what you're really about. Oh!
Oh no, bet bet the bet he has the shoujo anime in there. Straight up. Oh, he really killed that motherfucker. Cause I brought you the fucking shoujo, girl. Oh, fellas. Oh, friendship chat. Man, you guys didn't do shit, Gin. Oh, at least you saw him. Alright, cool, cool. My boy Hemroid Boy. My boy Hemroid Boy came with the clutch. Dude, if you get hit by... I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say this right now. Hemorrhoids are not fun. I'll tell you that. We're gonna be moving on to episode... 64, but let me tell you right now, hemorrhoids are not fucking fun. I've had one before, um, and they last for so long, like so long, and they never, and they don't go away, and it's just the most irritating thing ever. That's my TED Talk. Anyways, if you guys are enjoying the Gintama stuff, make sure to leave a like and a comment. Go check out the Patreon if you want to see this episode uncut. We're close to... 100 Patreons on Patreon, on Patreon. Uh, four away, so make sure you go peep it. Shout out to my Patreons. I love y'all. Let's get pushing. About who? Oh, Katsuro? He saves the weak and conquers the powerful, the last samurai. We cannot reveal his name or we've kept his face hidden. The mysteries veil surrounding the anti-foreigner faction is about to be lifted and the truth revealed. Oh shit. Okay. Cool. Donnie in Japan special to unstoppable one day un undercover. Huh? Bro, even even if like Oh, this isn't live. But even though I I wouldn't even trust them to like keep my identity like confidential, you know? Like how do I know you're not you're just not going to scam me and just like uncensor this shit? Or is this live? That's even worse. It's not Katsura, it's Katsura. <laughs> Remove it right now. Doing such an obscene thing to a person's face is unacceptable. So is this live or is it recording? I guess it doesn't fucking matter. I'm assuming it's live. I'm under disguise right now. <laughs> bro bro i thought i was <laughs> i thought i was gonna be elizabeth under there i'm gonna keep it a buck i dead ass thought it was gonna be elizabeth under there like right right when the fucking censored went away it would have been elizabeth master of disguise by the way Labeled criminals, terrorists, gorillas, and dangerous men. <laughs> She's like, what the fuck is he talking about? What's the meaning of the ramen noodles during an interview? Bro, bro, he's selling himself. <laughs> Dude, I had some soup today, fellas. That shit was gas, and this makes me want to have some more. <laughs> you want to broadcast the mission of the anti foreigner faction to everyone watching? And you want each viewer to uh, ponder about what can be done before this country. Bye, Polina. Bye. Have a good day, uh, class. He's totally misunderstood, bro. He's so dumb. <gasps> oh, 
What the fuck? Not Elizabeth, dude. Oh, let's go, Elizabeth. Shit on him. Damn, damn right. The counter's all blown up. That's fucked up. Because I have tasty stick snacks on me at all times? What the fuck is that? Have, okay, chill. The often dis disintegrates into powder because I hold onto it for so long. Bro, what is he talking about? Fuck him up. Damn. He was took it for Ura. What the fuck? How is he managing to escape so much? When you're a big name like me, you recognize immediately on the streets. Are you ignoring me? <laughs> Absolutely ignored your shit. You haven't done anything that an anti foreigner patriot would do. He just blows shit up, right? Straight up, he just goes to the places, blows shit up, and leaves. Oh, he knows how to work the camera. Straight up. What the fuck is that? This is the first time people other than our comrades have been inside. No shots. And they're all fucking eating that dumb shit. <laughs> I like that too. <laughs> We exchange ideas and viewpoints with those in higher positions. Oh shit. Force and change them within the nation. It's like with this show, like I literally Yo, what's up, Naruto V? Yo. With this show, I literally have to be like glued to the subtitles. Cause if I let go a little bit, like this is this is like a show. This is a show where like I would consider watching the dubbed just because like it kind of like rolls back to like how people feel about watching subbed and but people that never watched sub before and like oh, I don't want to read while I'm watching like this one like bro they breeze by the subtitles so fucking quickly like you really have like you know you really gotta fucking pay attention break them up Why are they fighting? The exchange of information is casually done in secret code. Depending on the passion one feels, there may be a confrontation. What the fuck? You do not see. He's the embodiment of the unsightlessness of the entertainment world, and he's refreshing. Huh? Every time I get into a meeting hall, they attack. So they know where it is, motherfucker. Why do you go to the same spot? Bro, he's a fucking carpenter. <laughs> Sorry, I'm yawning. Not because the show's boring. Hi, spirit. Mwah. <laughs> where are they? Don't tell me this is Gin's house, bruh. Why would he come here? See? He's here. Oh, I must suck. <laughs> She's stealing from him? Look at, his, look at her fucking smile. Oh, shit. How does she know he had all those on her? <laughs> Dude, to 
Dude, dude, what the fuck is going on? Like, what is going on? <laughs> It'll leave a hole and Gintoki will scold me. Drink and look at some old photos and welcome a surprise guest. Bro. Oh my god. Nice fucking jump. Dude, they were spitting words at each other right now. Oh, that didn't hit. Who fucking shoots rockets for free? This man thinks he's eyes and true. Dude, Elizabeth is OD. <laughs> this is how an anti foreigner patriot. Oh, shit. It was better than Jackie himself. She fucking knocked out. Damn. We're in the middle of a shooting and action scene that surpasses even Jackie's. Is he referring to Jackie Chan? Why are we up here? Imagine you're in one of those houses and your roof collapses from a bazooka. Your day would be fucking ruined. No shit. Really? Not the afternoon? The whole day? Not just like the morning? Make sure you tell the people of this nation what kind of people we anti foreigner patriots were. Oh, nice throw. Oh, you're fucked up. He living that shit. I can't believe it. I like that saying. If you're always prepared, you can always... Or what do you say? Shut up. Everyone shut up. What do you say? Fuck that. If you are always prepared, you can remain calm. I like that. No matter what happens, there's nothing to fear. Basically, as long as you, like, are always fucking prepared, you can never be, like, surprised by anything. Gone. Damn, they got down there from there quick. That's a fucking Eiffel Tower. What is that? I know it's odd to ask this for an enemy, but please don't lay a hand, a hand on the woman in front of you. Oh, shit. Yo, he's fucking prepared as fuck. What the fuck? I admire you all for putting yourselves in the harm's way in order to report the truth. Yo, he's kind of OD. <laughs> Oh shit. Fool really asks. <laughs> this fool really asks. What's that ticking sound like, bro? Come on, man. That's his fucking that's his get up, bro. Damn, she really put him on an IV too. Or he really put her on an IV. And her hands are fucking feet are all fucked up. That sucks. That was a good episode. Those are good two episodes. The time, dude, I'm telling you, this stream that I just did. The time went by so fucking quick. I played Mortal Kombat 2, obviously. You guys saw that in the clip that I posted in the video. Um, but I had an enjoyable time with that. These episodes felt fucking quick as hell hell. And uh, yeah, man, I enjoyed myself. I hope you guys did too. If you guys enjoyed the reaction, make sure to leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you guys haven't. Come over to Twitch so you guys can hang out with me and the fellas and watch everything live and be a part of my Twitch community because I love my Twitch community. And if you want to see the uncut version of this episode along with anything else I'm watching on the channel, it's all on Patreon. Go check it out. With that being said, hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic rest of your day. Another day, another anime. This is your breath and the mother. Peace out, y'all. What if you're fitting in? That's fire. Like, ask him if he wants to go back to the human world. Let's see what he says. Fuck no. Fuck everybody in the human world. And my parents. I love my parents. I'm just saying. They sold my shit. Get to eat all I want. I can't even go to school. Yes.